from Tobago Christmas they reach in Fat Meadow With a bump piece and a quattro A violin and a banjo They say they always had a plan To give me family a parang They wake up my mommy right away When they ring out with this love way Maja Frio Get up hey, Like you are here the neighbor come growing You know girl Maja And welcome back to my channel. You are watching Life with A. Nochelle and Company. And when you have some time, like now, you hit that subscribe button so you will know when new videos are out. My channel is all about makeup and styling and just life in general. Sometimes I would take you guys out on a job to see how my day is done when I do makeup clients or even when I'm cooking or how I do my beauty routine. That's what the channel is about. But today now, Today's look is this monochromatic look. Monochromatic means the same color all throughout. So this color reminds you guys of what? Cranberry, right? Or wine. And since it's Christmas, I usually come up with a cranberry inspo theme to do a makeup look. But I said, you know what? This rounds are going a little trini on all ya. All you know I trini already. So I'm going a little trini on all ya, right? So this look is inspired by sorrel okay so for those of you who don't know what sorrel is sorrel is a fruit that is grown in the caribbean it's not something that you go pick off the tree and just bite into it like an apple and eat if you want to it's not a it's not a pickable fruit to eat right away this fruit is bright red and normally you boil it and you make a juice out of it and there are other things you could do with the sorrel as well some people use it to make tea and you could also use it in hair products cosmetics dessert so there are so many uh uses for this sorrel and in trinidad we usually do it during christmas time you must have sorrel with your christmas meal your christmas dessert just for the holiday season you must have sorrel sorrel resembles the sorrel juice that is and we don't go around saying sorrel juice but sorrel resembles cranberry juice or a deep red wine so that's why i decided for this round of holiday makeup why not do a sorrel inspired look and i think i did absolutely well with this simple sorrel inspired look so i want you guys to stay tuned for this and i'll just remind you guys when you have some time just hit that subscribe button and the like button right so let's jump into this and before we jump into this this is what sorrel looks like normally when you boil it you want to add some spices to it in trinidad we do cinnamon and clove maybe a bay leaf just a little bit of ginger jamaicans they put the whole ginger tree in their sorrel that's all <laughs> i ain't sure no shade that's a whole nother story but other than that stay tuned for this sorrel inspired makeup look Take a peek. Okay guys, so before we start the look, eyebrows are shaped and concealed. Must do that off camera because we're not trying to take too long with this video. And so many things have been happening why I have not recorded recently. I had my birthday yesterday, December 9th. We in December, okay. <laughs> all the Sagittarians <laughs> and it's World Cup so if you hear noise in the background which I would tune out with music World Cup is going on and then of course it's the Christmas season so before we get into it you all know gotta use my double-ended brushes for this look and the palettes that I'm going to be using will be Juvia's Place Masquerade palette I'm looking at the I think this is, I, I don't have the correct pronunciation, pronunciation, not pronunciation, it's not a noun, it's none, right? I think it's Zobo, and the other one is Calibre, so this one and this one, and then Juvia's Place Wahala Palette, and it will be the BU, and then I will be using a shimmer, let me pull back here, y'all can't really see it but it's going to be a maroon shimmer and then of course for the lips will be none other than juvia's place again with oh damn right 
this nice wine looking color Ooh, uh, sound like they almost had a goal today is France and England playing so probably at the end of this recording we'll know who win the game all right let's get into this guys Okay guys, this is the third time I'm recording this part. Try to focus. France just got their second goal. Anyways, um, so yeah, my eyes are semi done. And I did my foundation set with setting powder. And I wanted to do some light concealing and contouring. So I'm using Born This Way. I'm trying to focus. I'm trying to focus. Football plane. I'm trying to focus. Born This Way, Ethereal Light. Okay, so this is Too Faced and it's this kind of very high color and it's light and I don't really like it so that's why I'm using it for camera I'm not gonna use this when I'm going out because uh, I sweat a lot and I realized that it started to cake and I hate caking of any cosmetics on my face so just to highlight under the eyes and it yeah it's, yeah wow this is this is some serious highlighting and you all know the rest of it gonna get your contour and just fix that up a bit but I just wanted to highlight you know underneath my eyes there and I'll do a little bit on my nose right and when I come back I should have my eyelashes done and everything and then we're going to move into blush and lips so stay tuned so as my eyelashes dry I will be lining underneath my eyes with a black coal pencil for this look you guys already know, but I have to show it on camera. Need things for content. Look at that contrast between this eye and this eye. This eye, right? I mean, you could do this one if you want to be like super uh, natural. Look at, look at that. right and then I'm gonna line under my eyes with a nice deep maroon from one of the Juvia's place palettes All right, the look is definitely coming to come. I put my little ginger in the corner there and the sorrow look has definitely come to come, right? So now we're gonna finish up this monochromatic sorrow look with this wine color or ox blood color or sorrel color lipstick. And as I said previously, it's by Juvia's Place and it's called Oh Damn. Look at that, oh. The consistency of Juvia's Place lipsticks are amazing. This is matte, but it's not matte drying, it's matte creamy. Absolutely love this color. I did not line my lips. So I did not line my lips purposely because the lipstick is already dark. So oh my 
my god, I love this color. Wow. Mm -mm. Okay, guys, so this is the final look. What say ye? What say ye? Let me come out a little bit. Oh, this in. And come out. Come out. Come out. See? I'm all monochromatic and then the gold hair and the earrings kind of matching the little ginger gold that I put there. So, hope you guys try this look. It, this was really simple. This was a simple look and I always try to do simple looks so you guys could indulge in makeup. Makeup is so fun. It's freeing. When I mean freeing, it, it gets you in a mood, you know? It gets you in a real nice happy mood because when you see yourself after and you look real good, you're like, oh damn. Just like the lipstick, oh damn. You know what I mean? So again, hope you guys try this look. And again, this has been inspired by the fruit, sorrel, as well as the drink. And as I show you guys, sorrel is definitely monochromatic, right? It looks just like cranberry, but it's not. So I will take a drink up for this look. Mmm. No. It's Christmas when you have sorrow. Oh my god, yes. Mm -mm -mm. Alright guys, so I will see you for the next video. And I'll try to do another one, you know. Uh, but if not, happy holidays and Merry Christmas. Let me do another one because I really want to tell you guys Happy New Year. Alright guys, bye.